that really spread nicely. So I decided I'll just coat these things. They'll look like gold. Had bar shoes in the front, nice shoes behind, all golden. And as I was finishing up making them, a little girl about 10 years old comes up to me at the truck and she says, are those golden horseshoes? And I lied to her. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, yeah, they, they are. She went on, I gave it no more thought. So the exhibitor party is in the evening. I shower up and go back to go to the party. Well, I walk in to the party and a lady says, John, come here. So I go over. She said, did you really put golden shoes on Largo? Well, I already was lying, so I had to stick, <laughs> I had to stick with it. I said, yeah, yeah, I did. She said, what did that cost? I said, a thousand and some change. She said, well, I'd like to have that done. <laughs> well, anyway, I mean, I, I, I was just bombarded by these people. One lady had a horse that she retired, and she wanted gold shoes on it to just <coughs> live with them on, you know, for no purpose. <laughs> well, anyway, to get back to the story, somehow there was a leak in this golden shoe thing. The radio picked it up. <laughs> Come to the Grand Prix, see the horse with the golden shoes. <laughs> it's like the horse that went up the glass hill to save the princess. Yeah. Well, anyway, the news gets out. I went over the next morning to shoe the horse, and there's people all around. I put these shoes on. The radio picks it up again. So, it's time for the Grand Prix. Here comes Largo walking up this tan bark road. There's people four and five deep on each side. They know nothing about horses, but they came to see the horse with the golden shoes. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, the class starts and he goes around and and the, the announcer said, and here is the horse with the golden shoes. Ah! <laughs> they're, they're screaming. So then he comes into the ring, and it's quiet, real quiet. And I'm, I'm hoping this golden horseshoe job wins, because <laughs> I will be famous. <laughs> so here he goes. Perfect, perfect, and it's quiet, and he's clear, and they're screaming again. All right, so he's in the jump off. Here's the horse with the golden shoes, and these people are screaming like crazy. They want this horse to win. So did I. I was going to be famous. <laughs> <laughs> so here he comes, and it's quiet. Shh. 
and you could just hear his feet hit boom, boom. So he comes past me where I was standing. Oh, okay. Don't let me knock you down. <laughs> <laughs> Red dog Joe the Sermon Well anyway, he comes the horse comes and he's going past me. I look up at the clock and he's two seconds ahead. He's got two jumps to clear. Here he comes, next to the last jump. He jumps it, he's perfect. Then he went out the out gate. <laughs> <laughs> and my horseshoe and buddy says, I told you. Those gold shoes are too heavy. <laughs> <laughs>